Hello everyone, this is Fernando from Fixed Phones. Today I'm gonna show you how to bypass a Google account on the Moto G Pure. Make sure your phone is connected to Wi-Fi. I'll be showing you that this phone is Google locked. just takes a couple of minutes click on don't copy here as you can see the phone has screen lock and we're gonna make sure this has the google lock on it as you can see the phone is google locked so we have to go back to the startup menu Click on emergency call. Click on emergency information. Click on it twice. Click on the icon on the top. Press on name. Then select the circle icon. Click on choose an image. Then click on the three dashes on the corner. Then press and hold the photos. Click on permissions, click on the search icon, type in Chrome. You should be able to see Chrome icon. Once you see it, click on it, click open, accept and continue, no thanks. Then you have to type in this link. Once you're done, just click search. Here you have to download this launcher. Click on OK, then open. Click settings. Here it should show allow the source, but if it doesn't show you this option, that means the phone has been updated, so it won't let you allow it. So in this case, we have to go back. Here you have to click on permissions, click the search icon, then click on the microphone on the keyboard, deny. One more time, deny. This time you have to allow. Here you have to click on permissions, click on the search icon, type in settings. Then scroll down all the way down till you find settings click on the second one then click on open here I'm gonna scroll down about phone and as you can see this is the Moto G Pure and it has the Android 11 and it has the latest update this method should work on the Moto G Play. Go back, go to accessibility. Click on it. Scroll down. Click on accessibility menu. Turn it on. Allow. Hit got it. go back back go under apps and notifications see all apps click on the three dots on the corner click on show system apps scroll down gotta find android setup
once you see it, click on it. Click on force stop. Okay. Go back. Scroll down till you find Google Play Services. Click on it, click on force stop, disable, go back, you have to go back all the way to the startup menu. Here click on start, skip, give it a couple seconds then go back, click on skip, continue, accept and continue, next, then quickly go back. go back here we have to swipe up click on click on assistant settings enable go back skip continue accept and continue next more accept skip skip if this video helped you out please leave a like and comment if you have any problems i'll get to you as soon as i can Now what I like to do is to go to settings, go under system, reset, then do a factory data reset. Thank you for watching.